Hi all and uh, welcome to the analysis video of the paper 2 of MCS 2023 prelims exam. Now this paper 2 is essentially a qualifying exam and I have also made a video giving the last minute tips for this exam which is also on my YouTube channel. Hope you have watched that before giving the exam and your exam went well. It seems that it was a lengthy uh, paper and many people could not complete it. So let's first see the uh, breakup of questions which has come. This will greatly help the aspirants who will be appearing in the next iteration of the exam. So from decision making, we had eight number of questions. Decision making and problem solving is essentially uh, they'll give you a scenario and some certain set of uh, conditions and then you'll have to make a decision uh, the right uh, the most appropriate uh, response then we have logical reasoning and analytical ability some kinds of facts and statements will be given and you have to draw some kind of logical conclusion and correct the i mean <laughs> select the correct response uh, then we have general mental ability so just some kind of uh, you know uh, mathematical like uh, figures or uh, diagrams will be given and you have to draw some inferences so that we had 15 and then basic numeracy class 10th level uh, we had uh, 16 and then one miscellaneous random question was there and then comprehension had 28 questions 28 so this uh, you know so this was the breakup and if you uh, if we analyze the breakup of the the type of passages will which came two on history two from history so this we analyzed last time also that history is very important and sometimes they just pick up paragraphs from history and uh, two, I, uh, I think from somewhere from the uh, newspapers, uh, articles published on health. So uh, first of all, very lengthy, lengthy paper uh, because the passages, uh, comprehension questions were uh, more and you need more time to read and stuff. And uh, so that is why some people uh, shared that they have missed certain questions. They can, could not uh, complete the questions. So please go back to my video on the last minute tips and how to attempt the three phase uh, approach to question papers that has to be followed, speed run, then come back to those where you have some possibility of answering correctly and then to those who don't know. So that is uh, very important that we come up with this kind of um, approach to ensure that we finish this exam. So if you see the overall uh, things, right, I mean, generally in these kind of questions, what you have to do is uh, get more than one third of marks. So if you see comprehension itself is 28 questions. So these are the things which you can get right for sure. There is no, you know, possibility, no, no gray. Uh, this is white and black. So those kind of questions you have to attend. So for example, basic numeracy. So if you have a decent level of class 10 maths, this 16 questions came in basic numeracy, you can get it 100% correct and you know that this is correct. So this is, you know, something which you should, um, you know, make sure basic numeracy, get everything correct. Then this general mental ability and logical reasoning. These are also a little bit of maths and numbers and figures. So this is also you can be very sure. So 16 plus 15 plus 12. These questions you can be 100% sure that I have marked, you know, if you have done it. So they are correct. So that is the best approach because comprehension can be sometimes. I mean, although the I saw the passages which were very basic, but sometimes the passages can be very abstract and tricky and inferences can be drawn and that can be a little challenge. So and so is decision making because there can be subjective weightage to different kind of uh, answers and there may not be one single correct answer. So that's uh, kind of tricky. So if you just want to get through basic numeracy gentle mental general mental ability and logical reasoning can you you can be sure that these answers are correct and then you can go for it but if you are not if you are like not comfortable with maths and figures and facts then you can work on your comprehension skills and also decision making questions so this is the simple analysis and mostly it has stayed the same as last year so pattern remains the same so for all the future aspirants uh, if you see my analysis of 2021 and this present analysis i think it should be uh, enough to guide you well on how to prepare for this uh, paper two. So anyway, and paper one analysis video is also out. If you want me to, uh, you know, work on the answer key of paper one, that uh, so that depending on your responses uh, to this video and the previous video, 
I will make a call. But anyway, do not wait for the cutoff. If you think you have done well, then just go ahead and prepare. And if you have not done well, then uh, simply again, you have to prepare. So in both cases, you have to prepare only. So do not um, you know, take a big break. Just start your preparations again. Thank you for watching. Hope you are liking this video and enjoying uh, this uh, you know, MCS uh, guideline uh, guidance videos. And if you uh, want help in... Uh, some particular and some peculiar uh, areas of this MCS preparation, do let me know in the comment section. Thank you so much for watching.